Can the moonlight power a solar panel? That's a question that tickles the mind, doesn't it? You see, the moon doesn't generate its own light, it's not a self-illuminating celestial body, instead, it acts like a giant mirror in space, reflecting the sunlight that hits its surface. Now, this reflected light, the gentle glow we lovingly call moonlight, is significantly less intense than the direct sunlight. In fact, it's estimated that moonlight is about 1 400,000th as bright as the sun's light, that's quite a difference, isn't it? This dramatic contrast in brightness is what makes moonlit nights feel so tranquil and serene as opposed to the vibrant and energetic daytime. So, if moonlight is just reflected sunlight, can it power a solar panel? Sunlight, the primary source of energy for solar panels, is immensely powerful. The sun's radiant energy drives solar panels, converting its light into usable electricity. On a sunny day, these panels can generate a significant amount of power, harnessing the sun's rays to fuel our homes and cities. Yet what happens when the sun sets and the moon takes its place? The moon, though beautiful and captivating, does not emit its own light. Instead, it reflects the light of the sun, and its power is but a fraction of the sun's luminosity. In fact, the light we see from the moon is only a tiny sliver of the sun's full force. Solar panels can indeed absorb some energy from the moonlight. However, this energy is minimal, producing only 0.2 to 0.3% of their daytime output. The moon's pale, reflected light simply does not pack the same punch as the sun's direct, powerful rays. Given the stark difference in power, it's clear that moonlight isn't as effective as sunlight. But does it mean it's entirely ineffective? Solar panels can indeed generate power from moonlight, but it's a different story when it comes to efficiency. You see, while these energy-converting marvels are designed to absorb sunlight, they can also soak up some energy from moonlight. However, the rate at which they do this is significantly reduced. We're talking just 0.2 to 0.3% of their daytime energy output. To put it into perspective, that's like trying to fill a swimming pool with a teaspoon. It's possible, but it would take an incredibly long time and a lot of moonlit nights. Most modern solar panels even have a sleep mode they slip into when the sun goes down. This is due to the negligible energy production during the night. After all, it's more efficient to rest and recharge, ready to soak up the sun's rays come dawn, than to expend energy trying to wring power from the much dimmer moonlight. So while moonlight can power a solar panel, the output is minimal, but what about other innovative approaches? Innovative technologies can potentially enhance the moonlight's role in powering solar panels. One such technology is the use of solar thermophotovoltaic cells, or STPV cells for short. These cells can store heat received during the day and potentially generate electricity at night. Imagine a solar panel that doesn't sleep, but works around the clock, come day, come night. Another intriguing concept is the use of the temperature differential between the panel and the vast expanse of outer space. At night, this differential can be utilized to generate power. It's like the solar panel is drawing energy not just from the moon's light, but also from the frosty void of the cosmos. These approaches, while still in their infancy, show great promise. They offer a glimpse into a future where we might not be entirely dependent on the sun for our solar energy needs. Instead, we could turn to our celestial neighbor, the moon, and even the cold emptiness of space, to keep our lights on. While the moonlight's power may be minimal, these innovative approaches hint at a future where we harness not just the sun, but also the moon, for our energy needs.